Hello kids, it's me, Miss Olivia, and welcome back to another English video lesson. Today, we are going to talk more about writing sentences and how to write better sentences. Okay, so let me see if you remember what we learned last time. Do you remember last time in our previous lesson, we talked about the four things we need to pay attention to when we are writing. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's right. We need to pay attention to our grammar and spelling, punctuation, and capitalization. Great job, kids. You remembered. So now, let's put your writing skills to a test. Wow! So, now, we are going to practice fixing some sentences. Let's look at the first sentence. Okay, first, I want you to tell me, is this sentence right or wrong? This is the sentence. My family have four members. Okay, what do you think? Is this sentence correct or incorrect? Mm -hmm. Yes, this sentence is incorrect. Now, what's wrong with this sentence? Right. All the four things we need to pay attention to. Okay, we have grammar. Here, it uses the wrong verb. My family. There is one family. So, we need to change the verb. That's the grammar. What about spelling? Yes, the word family is misspelled in this sentence. Next, what about punctuation? Look at the end of the sentence. It's missing something. It's missing a punctuation. All right. And what about the beginning of the sentence? Yes, that's right. We need to capitalize the first letter. Okay, so let's look at the correct sentence. Right, now this is the correct sentence. My family has four members. Capitalization, spelling, grammar, and punctuation. Great job. Let's look at the next one. Okay, this time I want you to choose the correct verb to complete the sentence. Let's look at the sentence. We blank to watch movies in the evening. We blank to watch movies in the evening. Now, what verb do we need to complete this sentence? Is it like? Or is it likes? Liked? Or like? Mm -hmm. Yes? Yes, you're right. We need the verb like. We like to watch movies in the evening. Great job. Let's move on to the next one. Mm -hmm. This time, you need to choose the correct punctuation to complete the sentence. The sentence is, do you have a pet? Do you have a pet? Okay. Do you need an exclamation mark, a question mark, or a full stop? Okay. Which one do we use when we're asking a question? It's... Yes! A question mark. That's right. Now, this sentence is correct. Do you have a pet? Great job. Great job, everybody. You have passed the skills test. Now, let's apply the skills that you have 
in writing by writing about your family. So now I want you to write about your family. So tell me about your family. You can write about how many people are there in your family, what are their names, what are the names of the members of your family, and you can describe your family members, you can talk about their face, their height, their age, job, personality, and so much more. And let me know what do you and your family like to do together. Okay, I can't wait to read about your families. This has been Miss Olivia. I'll see you next time. Goodbye, kids.